you may not be able to tell but I heard this area got some pretty substantial rains over the weekend and I came back to look that is the top to a bolt or something like this that holds a part of the old tracks together but look, the, it got so high, there was a bottle shoved up in there. And everything is cleaned out. It looks, it looks different. I mean, it may look the same to you. So I decided to come back to this area and look. And see what new items may be laying on the bottom. That's a big old hunk of brass, isn't it? But there's several things. One of my semi-new swishing spots um, has large rocks in it. There's railroad spikes. Man, if I could clean all this out, this would be a job, though. I hear a choo-choo train. I just fell in the water. Again, I knew I was going to. I knew it. I knew it. And they promised me that this phone is waterproof. Oh my goodness, how to do that right off the bat. It's kind of my, my new yellow shirt. And I know that green rocks are slippery. <laughs> I didn't realize I had the camera turn on. This phone had absolutely better work I'm gonna go put it back in the truck goodness gracious I can't believe I just did that it's funny when you slip and fall and you try to catch yourself you use muscles that you haven't used in a while <laughs> and you just kind of laugh and laugh till tomorrow morning but in all the mayhem, look, I'm glad it, oh, my grippers are a little slow, but look, as I was standing here pondering if I was okay, I'm okay. There's a spoon. It's got a little uh, underwater slug on it. I'm going to go put my phone up. I don't know, maybe I'll just put it in the other pocket. I don't know. Did you hear me? I sound like I had a pretty serious breathing disorder when I was falling. <laughs> I didn't realize that I had already pushed record what I am doing. I'm glad it's actually rained a lot because that means all the stagnant garbage water has moved down. <laughs> I'm still laughing with my person. Man, those rocks are slick. I'm still laughing. Knife case, machete case, filter cover, who knows. I think I twisted something in the old back. The thing that holds my body upright. But I'm okay. I think if I uh, <laughs> run through here then I'll be okay. What is that? Well, I may as well stick my hands in it now, huh? That's just a handle. Off of something. I was trying to stay clean. But no. <laughs> well, look at that big old hole. That's a new hole. Remember, we came here last time and did some, uh, Early initial swishing right here, and then went up through there. Let's go around. I don't know why. I'm trying not to get water in my boots. When I just did the creek side shuffle. <clears throat> what is that? 
There's a piece of a what? Spider. So where's the rest of it? You know the bummer is I gotta drive home soaking wet. But that's okay. It's all changed. Ooh, look at that phone. I hope mine doesn't turn out like that. I'll take it, because I put it with a pile. There's a green piece of slag right there. There's a saucer dish platter apparatus. Man, I bet my cleat, my cleat, my creeks are cleaned out. What's that? Paint roller. Thermostat. That'll wake you up. It's still pretty early in the morning. The world is asleep. I don't know if that's what I think it is. It's not what I think it is. I thought that was a jar seal. Yeah, let's go. What's the worst could happen? Fall down again? There's something shiny. I can't get it. Five stray dogs just walked by. I don't know if they're related because a couple of them were sowing the seeds of love. Sowing the seeds. Oh yeah. You remember this spot? This is where I found the uh, the ring. It's different though. None of this was here, remember? Seems like it was yesterday. Let's just go look. <laughs> Everywhere. Gotta harvest it though. Tape measures are always drawn to creeks. There's only a few people up in this town this early in the morning. And they're the ones that never went to sleep last night. <laughs> I'm gonna make it quick. I just wanna get it. Oh, I didn't bring my gloves. But that's okay. I don't plan on doing a lot of swishing. I'm just looking for the obvious right now. So let's go up here. This is the spot I saw from the road, maybe want to stop. I think we should go back and uh, look in the big hole again. I wish I'd been here when it flooded. Look, this is about as high as my neck. It's just below face height. And look, you can see where everything's washed up on the sides. So this joker was full. Man, I wish I'd been here. I'm gonna watch the weather. Really can't help but watch the weather. If your eyes are open, 
you see weather. But I want to know when that happens next time. That is a yard plant, isn't it? The Miscus papropomus, I think is what that one is called. Let's look in here where everything gets wedged up. There is a rather large worm from the earth. I'm not getting the worm, I'm getting that. That's a... Okay, I gotta get the worm. Look how big that worm is. Blech. I don't like worms here. I'm on the other side, obviously. Let's get back down in here and look a bit. I'm sorry to be stumbling around so much, but I'm just stumbling around a lot. There's a couple more spots in this town I want to check since it has rained so much. That is half of a vice. brings back memories. I don't know if I've found one of those before or if this is the one that I found. I don't think it is that old. I don't see anything written on it. I see something. I see a coin down there. I was trying to get that knife out and I think I see a coin. I could be wrong. I think I see a spoon. I think I can't get it out. There's the coin. I cannot see it. There's a modern shoe penny, and the other thing is not a spoon. Yeah, I need gloves on. I may go get them. Sure looks like a spoon though. They, these are good little swishing spots. I may get my gloves and do a little work around right in here. I know what you're thinking. Just do it and quit telling us about it. Oh, look at this. That minnow beached itself. Probably did it on purpose. I'm getting my gloves. 30 minutes later, somewhere in Alabama. Okay, I made it back. I walked back and got my gloves because I want to know what is in here. In this spot. And I think it'll be an easy clean. As long as the water moves, okay.
That knife must have been down there a while because it is not coming out. I need that big railroad thing out of there. It's in my way. Usually if you swish around stuff. First of all you gotta break these because they poke you in the side of the head. And it feels like something is uh, climbing up on your person. Get the rocks out of the way. We'll move from this spot in a minute. I just wanted to look. So it looks like a nice little collection spot. Wow, the fish are coming up. Man, that knife's not coming out of there. I thought the other thing was a spoon, but it is not. All right, we'll do this a couple more minutes, then I'm done. Right here. I need my railroad spike back. There it is. If I could get below that thing, I'll do it maybe concrete it in. That knife's not coming out. It's gonna stay. So let's go to another spot. Let's look right here. You want to? I gotta not fall again. Maybe we can simply move this big rock. No, you can't move that big rock. Let's look for another spot. These big slabs are the... <laughs> The two farthest green ones, that's where I did my safety dance before I lay down in the water. Which was after school, I took a dip in the pool. Then I laid down. I need my grippers. This is the thinking about it part. When I'm just standing here looking around. I don't see anything else. Is it that? What is that? Maybe an old wrench? Maybe time to press on to another spot. So what I've learned is cell phones are biodegradable. And green rocks are still slippery. So let's head out. Thanks for watching this video.